Ministry of Education, Technological and Vocational Training became aware of an altercation between two students from the Frederick Smith School. It occurred just after 1.30 p.m. today, and during that altercation, one of the students was stabbed. Um, I believe that the principal, Mr. Jackman, would be able to give you further details with regard to the incident. But what I can say, it's very unfortunate that such an incident occurred today. Um, we can see that there is an increase in violence um, within our society. And we are seeing a bit of that within our schools as well. And I would urge all persons... Um, from, from the schools, from the communities, to assist us in our efforts to reduce the kind of violence that we are seeing in our society, within our schools. I can tell you that this term, the theme, is peace. We are promoting peace within our schools, and our principals have started that by incorporating that theme within their morning assembly. The teachers are incorporating it within their lessons, and we have a number of programs planned throughout the term to promote peace within the schools. I can tell you also at the Frederick Smith School, there is a plan to relaunch the obvious bullying program. And that should be happening next week. Um, so we recognize that we have to do work as a ministry. We have to do work um, as principals of schools and as teachers. However, as I always say, we can't do it alone. We need the support of, of the parents um, children are becoming smarter and smarter. They know that the principals are searching. They know that at times they might be scanned. And instead of bringing the weapons into the school, some of them are stashing the weapons off campus. And while we have the principals responsible for the school and what is happening in the environs, uh, we need the support of the community. When they see something, say something so that we can prevent incidents such as this at, uh, from happening. Um, so I will turn over now to Principal Jackman, who will be able to tell you a bit more about the incident today. Good evening. At approximately 1.37, the police came onto the compound and said that they had heard there had been a stabbing. They then indicated that the stabbing took place in the area by the vendors. I followed the police to the area where I found one of my second form students, a 15 year old, sitting in a chair and he had three stab wounds to his body. An ambulance came, he was provided medical assistance and with his parent he was transported to the police station. The alleged perpetrator was nowhere to be found and information has been given to the police to assist with finding him. As hard as we try in this school to minimize the possibility of violence we are finding it more and more difficult to police both the environs of the school and the area outside of the school like here where the vendors associate we are asking everyone for help and we are asking the parents especially to teach their children that there is an alternative to a violent response to everything that happens